Hi, this is Simon, the chef half of ABC TV's The Cook and the Chef. Welcome to our vodcast where you'll find bonus cooking tips and program extras. There are more vodcasts at abc.net.au forward slash TV forward slash video. And don't forget to watch The Cook and the Chef Wednesday nights at 6.30 on ABC TV. See you then. John, it's great to get up here because I've been meaning to come for ages and I actually can't believe how big the, the buggers are. No, they're thumpers. Some of these would be uh, dressing as heavy as lambs, I would think, around uh, 18, 19 kilos or more. So how, how, how old to get to that size? 26 weeks ago, these birds would have still been inside an egg, so they weigh 50 grams when they arrive from the hatchery and when they arrive, they're just like a chicken. They put, put in sheds uh, under gas heaters for about six weeks. So they need the warmth. They've got it, yep. Yeah. Yep. Then after that, they go outside in some intermediate sheds. And um, the intermediates to stop the foxes? Foxes or? and also uh, just temperature, that sort yep. of stuff, especially in the wintertime. So you're bringing them around slowly yep. to get yep. to this yep. stage. And when they get to about 12 weeks, they all go outside so we can say that they've got a free-range status. And what about the boy-girl boy thing? you got males and females in here? At the hatchery, they can sex them, so yep. these big fellas keep growing, yep. whereas the hens get to about 10 kilos and start putting on a bit of fat over their back okay. and tail. And it's a lot more economic to have these blokes that just keep performing all through the life. So how'd you get into this crazy game? What made you do this? I used to be a shearer and hurt my leg shearing and couldn't get back into that, so we just bought 40 as a bit of a hobby and yeah. uh, processed them in a very primitive way. and. Uh, did a few more and then it was obvious that there was a demand for the meat so we decided to build our processing plant and, and go from there. How long ago is that? 13 years ago. So what are you up to now from 40? What do you get through a year now? 15,000. Why do you free range? At first they had to be free range because we couldn't afford anything any better. Yep. So we've just stayed with the free range and it's a little bit untidy at certain times of the year. No, but, but it's so. beautiful. Yeah. It's, it's really nice to see how healthy and happy they look. It's hard to imagine these creatures being locked up because they're just so every, they're all independent, doing something, and as you can see, just wandering around here. And, and they're curious, though. Yeah. You yeah. want to give them a TV? <laughs> they look fantastic. Mm. They look so clean. Yeah. And so, how does Jed come into it all? Well, we shift a lot of our birds. Um, obviously, you can't raise small turkeys outside, so a lot of birds get shifted yep. at different times. And uh, yeah, the dog just helps us like a. Uh, a farmer would do with sheep actually, just shift them around and uh, without him we'd be, be lost. Uh, we say shifting a mob of turkeys is a you know, good way to turn a sane man into an absolute lunatic. <laughs> <laughs> so he's good? Uh, he's good, but it's like when you shift turkeys it's like going to war, it's a battle yeah. of inches. Nothing happens quickly.